North Idaho newsroom tonight, the story of four grads from Coeur d'Alene High School who have launched a tasty business venture and all their customers arrive by boat. KXY4, Jeff Humphrey working for you tonight on his own boat. And Jeff, I hear you found a new place to eat there at the mouth of the Spokane River. <laughs> Dean, we spotted it just last weekend right where the river meets the lake. It is a converted houseboat with a fully functional kitchen that cranks out hot food, ice cream bars, so that you can get something to eat or drink without ever leaving the cozy confines of your own boat. You know my temperature rising, the it's like any other licensed mobile food operation. Freshness, refrigeration, and a clean cooking area are the only ways to keep your customers. But Chef Graham Neff whips up his culinary creations on the sometimes choppy waters of Lake Coeur d'Alene. So a big hit is our uh, chicken tacos. People are loving that. And if you like something um, a little more spicy, our uh, buffalo chicken sandwich is also a great one. The food is good on the buoy, but the convenience might be even better. Summers don't last long enough around here, and so this floating operation is built for speed. A time saver for skippers who want to be on their boat every second they can. We have an easy um, technique where uh, the customer can text our number and then automatically a menu is sent to their phone. And if they like what they see, they can uh, give us a phone call, place their order. That means boaters like this family visiting from Sacramento can spend 15 more minutes cruising the lake. Rudy, your food is ready. Thank you. Before they're told their tacos, burgers, and dogs are ready. You're welcome. Bye. The buoy's business is booming, and that's because there's just something unique about this snack shack slash ice cream stand on the water. Maybe it's getting your food handed to you in a fishing net. Maybe it's the entrepreneurial spirit of four young men trying to fill a niche in the Coeur d'Alene marketplace. It's a wonderful thing, and they hope to expand, so they need voters to come out and support them. Stop by and order some food, and we might see more of them down towards Harrison and on down to St. Mary's. And Nadine, unfortunately, as you can see, I've now picked up on a tail. I was only in the water for about five minutes. There's the Kootenai County Sheriff's Marine deputies keeping the Spokane River safe. That's where we're reporting love uh, live from tonight. The buoy restaurant that we just saw, that's open from Thursday through Sunday. Get a noontime uh, lunch there, or they also serve uh, afternoon snacks, and sometimes they'll move over, over in front of the Coeur d'Alene Resort, but it's, there's no, it, it's easy to find that boat. There's, you'll know it when you see it and they're nice fellows aboard stop on by and have some great food reporting live on the river i gotta deal with these guys jeff humphrey kicks oh, a lot you're a safe skipper or maybe they want to know where you got your hat jeff that might be it yeah right, maybe that's what it is <laughs>